Okay, part two of yesterday. We're saying, make yourself knowledgeable of this fact, ingrain within your heart the undeniable fact that you have only today. You'll certainly succeed both spiritually and physically, and your entire attitude about life will change completely. So let's focus on this. If we do this, we're going to succeed. That's a big promise, success. We all want success. So if we don't postpone anything tomorrow, and we realize even more, you must certainly do all that you can do today and not postpone anything tomorrow. And if we live that way, with that mode of operating then as if we have no tomorrow at all, um, but then, then we will be successful. So, spiritually and physically, your entire attitude about life will change completely. So, let's say I really only have today. Okay, so I'm going to make sure every, you know, I'm not that I'm going to die, but like I can only accomplish today and tomorrow will be what tomorrow is. And I've, I've cut off the future from my mind. That is awesome. So that is the reward for working on this. So let's let's review. And um, real quick, we have to make sure we do all we can today, not postpone anything for tomorrow. We have no tomorrow at all. This is true for physical things and for spiritual dimension. By making yourself knowledgeable of this and internalizing it, we have only today, you will certainly succeed both spiritually and physically. Your entire attitude about life will change completely. So let's go for it. So let's work on internalizing it. Yesterday you made a list of what you wanted to internalize. And go for it. Go for it. Start internalizing. Now, how do you do that? How do you internalize? The best method I could think of, the simplest and most straightforward method is awesome, is you take a piece of cardstock or a hard piece of paper and you write down what you want. I heard this from the Machaber who wrote this book called Lavavi Mishkanevna, In My Heart I Will Build a Temple. And he said, just to look at it, um, which in cognitive therapy, a cue card, uh, many times a day. Really, and just make like every hour, take a look at it. It become more and more because uh, thoughts are food for the mind. And whatever I think about is what goes internal eventually for good or for bad or for both. All right. So pick your method of internalization, pick a system, and let's get busy doing that. Have a beautiful day.